hi YouTube now I will show you my changes in metro link button and I will also show you on how to use it so basically this is the changes I uh, just added the button an image to the button a normal image and the hover image changes you have yeah, I actually made two changes on the project first is on the metro framework design so we need to remove this so that it will accept image and of course in the metro link control under the metro framework so I added some properties like the image and then the no focus image and then also the image size and at the bottom part I added the draw icon okay so this will just accept the alignment that you will set on the property and also it will cater it will actually change based on the theme that you use so so that I don't need to add several images different image for dark theme and light theme okay and also this function and then the apply invert this is the one that's inverting the images okay so I will not explain this one by one I just show you on how to use it Okay, see? so we just need to add the metro link button okay, so by default it's just a text and then we can just add images under properties so we can just group it under the metro appearance so we can just add image so for example this one the refresh and then add the no focus image which is the gray one okay. so by default the size is 16 so based on the size of the image that you attach you need to change the image size so let's change it to 32 and then set the image alignment let's set it to left Okay, then adjust the size okay let's run it and that's it so what if you just want a plain button something like this so what we just need to do is delete the text and then resize your link button that's it and if you are going to ask on where I'm getting my images I usually browse the internet and usually I get my icons from flat icon and then icon finder so I'll just put the link in the description below and thank you for watching